as far as you can, sit on the front seat as close as you can. A few more of you can stand up closer. We're going to baptize this young man. Jesus said in Matthew, Matthew 28, 19, if my memory's right, he said, told his disciples, he said, I go away. He said, I want you to go into all the world, teach them to observe all things that I've taught you. And then he said, baptize them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Amen. Now, I reckon old Peter was there. He was one of the disciples. But later on in Acts, Peter said, in Acts 2, 22, 38, he said, uh, he that repenteth and is baptized in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ uh, shall be filled with the Holy Ghost. Receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. All right? So, I'm pretty sure Paul is going to baptize him. And he's going to use this word. We baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, and in Jesus' name. Now, we can get all hung up on, on the Word. The main thing is get baptized in the Lord. Amen. I, I, I don't like to argue uh, the Bible. I always do. Because I, every time I do, then uh, the, the Lord says you shouldn't have been arguing. So, so I, I, I just don't want, I want to stay away from that. Uh, because of, I don't, I don't like the chastity of the Lord, brother. Praise the Lord. Hey, amen. But let's just pray for this young man, and I think they will. I guess they're ready, and we'll turn it over to them. Austin, do you give your heart to the Lord? Praise the Lord. Do you know Jesus is the Savior? You know He died and rose again. Are you ready to go to heaven? Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Our Heavenly Father, in obedience to thy holy command, and upon confession of this our brother's faith, we baptize him in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, in Jesus' name. Burn it down, my soul, and all the way. 